Hi guys, Graham and my name's Josh. Yeah, here, pay for us. What we're going to talk about today is how to get someone to like you, and it's not just for one or the other; it's for both. So we're going to sort of assume what girls want guys to do based on our previous experiences. First thing, most important. If you're thing. a girl and you want a guy to like you, dress like a slut. Got to act camp, and then they'll. You, they'll let you watch him get changed. Graham's run away because he's got diarrhoea. Because I don't like the smell of your butt. He's got diarrhoea. The best way to get someone to like you is to be honest. I'm actually joking, it's to be the opposite of honest. Don't be yourself at the beginning of a relationship because no. No, no one ever is. Never. So, the person that you're with, they're lying, mate. They, they ain't themselves. You'll, you'll work it out. They ain't themselves. I'm never myself. I think the best thing you can do when you're starting a relationship with someone is to act all nice and sweet, get him to really, really fucking like you, and then be like, BAM! And then hit him with the whip, yeah? And the then, whip? Yeah, the whip. What, you mean just fucking you mean, whip You mean trick them, make them think you're nice, and then just assault the shit out of them? Yeah, make them fall in love with you, and then be like, oh, actually, no, make me a fucking sandwich. If you're a guy, you can uh, have a bit of a trim, you know? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, guys? If you're a girl, you can have a bit of a trim. Have a little bit. Yeah, no, girls, just get rid of it all. But if you're a guy and you get rid of it, it's a bit weird. You look like one of those schoolboys. It looks like a chicken. Pff, fuck nice. why is it there? I don't know to keep your shit in. Why is it? What the hell is it for? If you know what ass hair is for, comment on this video and let us know. So, let's uh, go for bullet points. Bullet point number one. Don't be yourself. Bullet point number two. So I call cans a dick. Bullet point number three. Pretend to be interested in everything that they say all the time, even though you're not. Just pretend. And don't don't talk about yourself. Just ask them loads of questions about everything they do. Ask them how many brothers they have, how many sisters they have, how many dogs they have, what pets they've got in general, even if it's a fucking hamster, who are little bastards. Anything. Anything. Just ask them all the questions you can think of. Look, I'll prove it. I'll... Right. Hey. Get the hell away from me, hey. No, get off Oh, that's me. another one. Bullet point four. Break the contact barrier like this. Get the hell off me, bro. Like that. Right, break the contact barrier. And they, um... Get the fuck away. Ball. Bullet point number five. Ball. Don't your listen power. to your friends. It's your relationship. You do what you want. Bullet point number six. Six. Is wear cool clothes. If they're a goth, Get yourself some studded shit and like some gimp masks and all that sort of stuff. If they're a chav, get yourself some, uh, some sort of shell suit. Number seven. Remember to keep hydrated. Always. Number eight. If you go on a date with them, if you manage to get that far from bullet points one to seven, follow all them, you should get to this stage. I don't, think, I don't think they will. You should. No. If you get them the date stage, right, first thing you do when you walk into a restaurant is go to the toilet and check if you don't have any bogeys hanging out your nose. No, no, no. People don't have, people aren't tattoo artists, they don't have this kind of money. What you do is you invite them over your house, that's what you do. You watch a film, you cuddle up to that, you get a blanket going. There you go. Blanket. Holding hands. Hands leads to leg touching. Leg touching either leads to that or... Ugh. But, right, if you're sitting down watching a film with a girl, you just go... I'm holding your hand now. Yeah, it's like it's like that game. It's like da 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 da. It's like the claw game. You grab the hand. And you, you grab the hand. And you put it on your dick. Number nine. You kind of you kind of put on a scary film, right? And you say to them, "Oh, so you know, is this gonna scare you? You you know, you can be alright." No, though if if they're a normal girl, they'd be like, "Oh no, it might be a bit scary." And you're like, "Oh, it's okay. Don't worry. I'll protect you. I'll protect you." And then you break the contact barrier with a little pat. Oh, I'll protect you. And then hopefully they'll do that. And then you get like this. Get away! You're right, what we do, you're right, this is the best move I can possibly show you, okay? So this is their arm, right? This is your hand. This is the best possible thing you can ever do. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, look at that. Yeah, can they rub that way as well? And a bit sideways as well. Backwards and forwards, yeah. There we go. Number ten, you take their drink and you put something in it. You put a drug in it. They drink that, they pass out. It was for taken. <sighs> Graham, we're giving them advice. You you can't people that search for this video, then they're, they're, they're gonna be like, 
I have dicks growing on my head. Oh, yeah. They're gonna have like 17 arms. No one searches for how to make people like you on YouTube. Yeah, well, maybe do they? people do. Just sometimes. use drugs. Drug them up. Okay, well anyway, that's uh, pretty much how it's done. That's how the, that's how we roll. That's how the pros do it. Um, so if you have any questions like that, you want to know, you know, any relationship advice, any problems you're having, send them a message and we'll make a video about it. Can't just wave. Can. This is the end of a video. These guys are going to be sad to see oh us god, go. Oh my god! I forgot the guitar. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Bacon and beans.